there is a high possibility for the wheel to travel on the wing rail and the train will derail. The check rails are placed with a fixed gap with the main rails on either sides. Even if the wheel tries to travel on the wing rail, the check rail wheel will prevent this. This will channelize the wheels to the track properly and the wheels will easily pass through the intended trajectory. Now let's understand the importance of a shorter tongue track. This is in fact considered a design optimization. Can you predict the maximum stress points in these switching rails? It is at the toe of the rail switch and the nose of the crossing. These components are very often replaced due to wear and tear compared to the main rails. This is why the tongue rail is divided into two parts. When the switch is at the end of its life, just replace the switch rail. By doing so, you can reduce the quantity of iron that needs to be replaced after it's worn out.